Hi guys, it's Joey Inchi here, and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm not reviewing the 718 Cayman, but I have a worthy substitute. I hope the BMW fanboys enjoy this, and come on, let's go check it out. This is a 2018 BMW F9 and trust me, it's one of BMW's finest creations. It's a real monster on four wheels and it's worth every penny if you ask me. Um, come, let's check out some stuff. Just as we know, spoilers give downfalls, but look at this teeny weeny spoiler here. Right? What, what sort of downfalls do you think this will give to the car? I don't know, but check this out. These quad-tip exhausts are real, and look at this diffuser. And unlike some cars, they would probably have made some mock exhausts with only two working. But these ones, they sound real good too. I'll let you listen to them very soon. So those who don't know, M stands for Motorsport, and saying Motorsport 5 won't sound real good. So BMW shortened it for us to say M5. How cool is that? The F90 is powered by a twin turbo S3 V8 and it brings out 600 horsepower and it has a 0 to 60 time of 3.0 seconds. Um, that's good news for this one, but I don't think it will uh, raise the E63 AMG. Let me give you a little fun fact about adaptive sensors. Well, in Ghana, we don't have snow, but here's the case if this thing is to be covered in snow, it automatically heats up and melts all the snow so that it doesn't block the sensors from working. How cool is that? Well, come on. Um, well, these pieces you can see on the bonnet are only featured on the M series. Well, if you don't have one, it means the car isn't an M. The F90 comes with a 20 inch tire and carbon ceramic brakes. Um, you see these vents here? Well, they look like little air vents, but they are not air vents. They are fake, but well, at least they are aesthetically pleasing. So, as you can see, the carbon fiber details on this car, this means money. You know, money you can't afford it. Carbon fiber is really expensive, and to have this on your car, it means you're driving a real pricey car. And this car isn't cheap either, it starts at 120,000. Every car guy is guilty of saying BMWs don't have good looking interiors, but I think here's the case where BMW have stepped up their games with their interiors. Well, you need to see this thing in person to admire its beauty and quality, and I think it's one of the best I've ever seen coming from BMW. So, these little red buttons are M preset buttons. So, let's say they, they are kind of a speed dial button so let's say you change your your settings and you want to switch on your mdm which mdm is a feature for bmw which switches your car into semi traction control on so let's say you've set your mdm control to m1 you double tap this and it will switch to your mdm on you need to double tap it to go off to m well this thread plays lights up in the night so when you come to sit in the car at night and you open your door these things lights up to remind you what you're driving and these ones too these two M5 badges in the seats actually light up too in the evening to remind you where you're driving. Well, how cool is that? Bro, so the exhaust notes sound very brutal and it's one of the best I've ever had. Well, check this out. 